Hi, this is Captain Joe. Welcome to Petals from the Basket and our reading for the Lord's Day, May 3rd. We're reading through the Psalms and the way we're doing it is taking the day of the month and adding 30 to each of the Psalm numbers and that way we read five Psalms. Now today we'll read some of Psalm 3 and then if you add 30 we'll read Psalm 33 and add another 30, Psalm 63, and if my math is correct, Psalm 93, and finally Psalm 123. If you read through the Psalms this way, you're able to cover most of the book of Psalms, but what you'll find is you'll find some things repeated in the Psalms, or you'll find something that'll stand out for you. Let me share with you what I've, I've discovered. In Psalm 33, 21, David says in verse, actually verse 20, our soul waiteth for the Lord. He is our help and shield. For our heart shall rejoice in him because we've trusted in his holy name. Let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us according as we hope in thee. When you trust in the Lord, you get hope. And you trust in his mercy, his, his forbearance, his loving kindness. And it says in Psalm 33, verse 21, I've my heart shall rejoice in him because we have trusted in his holy name. Proverbs 18.10 says, The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and is safe. That's a wonderful promise about God's name. You know, we just finished a study of the names of God. And remember what God's name is. That's what he does. So Psalm 33.21, talking about we trust in his holy name. God's name is not only right and true, but it's holy. It's without spot or blemish. Now, another verse, another psalm that we I, I came up with, Psalm 63. And David talks about being a thirsty soul. He said, my soul will be satisfied with the fat and rich food, and my mouth sh will praise you with joyful lips. When God satisfies us with his word, when he refreshes us with his word as a thirsty soul, we will praise him. That's the result of praise. And really, the Psalms are just a lot of, that. They're, they're prayers and praise, full of prayers and praises. You can pray the Psalms. You can praise with God with the Psalms. I'm reminded again, Isaiah 12, 2, my life chapter. And life chapter talks about drawing water from the wells of salvation. Psalm 123, I love this one. There's an old gospel hymn, when I looked up, he looked down. And listen to what the psalmist said. Our eyes looketh to looks to the Lord, our God. And we look to him. We're looking up to him. And when we do that, we look by faith. We look in prayer. And he looks down upon us. He's looking at us. He knows us. Wonderful way the psalms repeat various things, or at least things that stand out, that you can claim that day. I hope you'll enjoy and, and, and grow and, and praise the Lord from your reading of the Psalms with us this month. God bless you. Thanks for joining us.